Juventus just went from third to tenth without even playing a single game. The Italian Football Federation have hit the Bianconeri with a 15 points deduction. They artificially overvalued their capital gains. What the hell does that mean? To put it simply, there is regulations that limit the amount of losses a club can make. The Juventus have made losses of over 200 million euros over the past two seasons, but to escape fines and punishments, they gave their own players higher market values than they actually had. So their accounts actually looked like they were doing solid. Prime example for that, Juventus paid 76 million for Artur, and in return, Barca paid 60 million for a 30-year-old Pjanic. That sugarcoated the balance books of both clubs. And Juve did several transfers like that. So yes, if it's true, they probably deserve the punishment. But I've got two questions. The club says my player is worth 60 million euros. Can a judge really say, no, he's not, you lied? Who decides the real market value of a player? And the biggest mystery, almost a dozen clubs only in Italy were involved, but only Juventus got a punishment. This is kind of giving me flashbacks to a certain 2006 scandal. So send this video to a friend who wants to know why the hell 